Green Rock Mining, developers of the world-class Amidsoc Graphite Mine in Greenland, expect to benefit from a change in the mining law, which allows them to apply for an exploitation licence in the first half of 2024, earlier than previously expected. The highlights of the announcement are as follows. A positive change in Greenland's mining laws that became effective on the 1st of January is expected to significantly reduce the time needed for Green Rock to obtain an exploitation licence for Amidsoc. The exploitation licence application can now run in parallel with environmental and social impact assessment studies. The company is now targeting in the first half of 2024 to apply for an exploitation licence, paving the way for a licence to potentially be granted by the end of the year. The company have applied to extend the existing Amitsoc exploration package to include the last area of significant graphite mineralisation not yet under licence. And in other news, the exploration licence for the Melville Bay Iron project has been surrendered. This change in Greenland's mining laws reflects more favourable mining jurisdiction. The company is now expecting its licence to be granted this calendar year, which will assist Green Rock to secure development finance. Green Rock CEO Stefan Bernstein commented, The changes in the Greenlandic mineral law that came into effect on the 1st of January 2024 are very positive for Green Rock. The fact that our application for an exploitation licence can run in parallel with environmental and social impact assessment studies should significantly shorten the processing time for the licence. It also further illustrates Greenland's commitment to simplifying its mineral administration in order to establish a solid mineral extractive industry in the country.